Simulation tools enable engineers and designers to gain crucial information on a product's performance and strength through multiple loading scenarios. Simulation with Fusion 360 has done so on the same application, on the same model, even in the same environment. So no need to import and export files and worry about Autodate versions. Here's what you need to know about the simulation functionality included with Fusion 360. Setting up the simulation is where you convey the real-world loading conditions and constraints into the software environment. This section will include loads, constraints, as well as material definitions. Next, you'll describe how the parts interact. This is commonly referred to as contact. Contact is so critical to the simulation that Fusion 360 has an automation tool to help determine this behavior between components. When setup is complete, use the degree of freedom view to ensure that contacts and constraints have been made properly. And now you're ready to mesh. Meshing is where complex designs are broken down into simple elements. As results are affected by the mesh size, Fusion 360's automated mesh adaptation tools can be used to ensure the highest efficiency and quality. Finally, it's time to solve, then interrogate the results. Fusion 360 provides visual tools to help you understand how your design will react to the loads, forces, and other components of your design. Let's review. Simulation in Fusion 360 starts with a definition of materials, loads, and constraints. From there, a description of part-to-part -part interaction takes place with contact. To help ensure proper setup, use Fusion 360's Degree of Freedom view. The mesh directly affects result accuracy, and balancing solve time and accuracy is paramount to understanding simulation. After solving, interpreting results is vital to ensure that the next steps are given the right direction. In the next video, we'll discuss the steps and considerations required to set up CAM toolpaths for turn parts, milled parts, and laser cut and water jet setups.